You are watching Tutor Midge. Our lesson for today is under Mel C, Most Essential Learning Competency Code, M9AL-1A-B-1. Solve these quadratic equations by extracting square roots, factoring, completing the square, and using the quadratic formula. Okay, our topic for this day, solving quadratic equation by factoring common monomial factor. So, example, meron tayong x square plus 7x equals 0. So, ang unang step natin dito, i-factor out natin yung common to both x square and 7x na factor. So, both have x Ilabas na natin. So, mag-ready na tayo ng ating parenthesis equals 0. So, dito, i-divide natin ang x square by x para makuha natin kung ano yung maiiwan dito sa loob ng ating parenthesis. So, let us divide. x square divided by x. Ito ay x raised to the exponent of the numerator minus the exponent of the denominator. Okay, so sa mga nakalimot na, kapag ang variable ay walang exponent, automatic ang sinasabi niyan, may exponent siya na 1. Pero hindi lang natin ito nilalagay sa algebra. So, x as variable means ang exponent nito ay 1. Ngayon, pag nagdi-divide tayo, sinusubtract lang natin ang exponent ng numerator to the denominator. So that, we will have here x. Kasi x raised to 1 dapat ito, pero hindi na nga natin ilalagay ang ating exponent na 1. So ibig sabihin, may naiwan pa tayong x dito sa loob ng ating Parenthesis. Now, plus ang operation, ilagay na rin natin na plus ang operation dahil positive rin lang naman ang nilabas natin na x. Next, let us divide 7x by x. Okay. So, ito, mas madaling i-divide kasi nakikita natin na may common factors ang numerator at ang denominator which is x over x. Because x divided by x equals 1, kaya na-cancel out na siya dyan. So, ang sagot, 7. Idugtong natin ito sa ating binomial factor na nasa parenthesis. Ngayon, ready na tayo to solve the quadratic equation. So, ang i-apply natin dito, ay splitting muna. So, let us split the factors x and x plus 7, then equate it to 0. So, one of the factors is x, equate it to 0, and the other one is x plus 7, equate it to 0. So, ngayon, x equals 0 na to, ito na ang isa sa ating mga solution. Next, by additive inverse or by addition property of equality, kailangan natin matanggal si plus 7 dito sa ating left side of the equation. So, gawin natin. x plus 7, para maging 0 ito, mag-add tayo ng kanyang inverse. So, the inverse is negative 7. Take note, kung anong in mo dito sa left side of the equation, ganun din dapat ang i-add mo sa right side of the equation. So, ngayon, positive 7 plus negative 7, ito ay equal to 0. So, ang ating final answer is x equals 0 minus 7 is negative 7. 
So, ang isa sa mga factor natin ay x equals negative 7. Ibig sabihin, x squared plus 7x has the solutions x equals 0 and x equals negative 7. Okay, paano naman kung ang given ay 3x squared plus 6x equals 0? So, dito, tingnan natin maigi. Ano ba ang common factor ni 3x squared at ni 6x? So, both are divisible by 3 and both are divisible by x. So, ibig sabihin, ang isang factor natin dito ay 3x. Ngayon, hanapin natin yung binomial factor by simply dividing 3x squared by 3x. So, isulat muna natin. 3x squared divided by 3x. So, makakancel lang 3 because that is equal to 1. And then, gaya ng ginawa natin kanina, 2 minus 1, x na lang ang maiiwan. So, meron tayong maiiwang x sa loob ng ating binomial factor. And then, positive divided by positive, is positive. Next, 6x divided by 3x. So, sulat muna natin. 6x divided by 3x. So, x divided by x, cancel na. Dahil ito ay equal to 1. 6 divided by 3, meron tayong 2. So, meron pa tayong naiwang 2 dito sa loob ng ating parenthesis. Ngayon, lumako na tayo dun sa Splitting of factors. Burahin ko na itong division natin. Okay. So, split natin ang 3x at x plus 2 and then let us equate each by or 2, 0. So, meron tayong 3x equals 0 at yung isa ay x plus 2 equals 0. So, ngayon, kailangan x lang ang narito sa, sa left side of the equation para makuha natin yung value of x. So, 3x, kailangan matanggal si 3. So, i-divide natin both sides of the equation by 3. So, 3 divided by 3, that will be 1. And 0 divided by 3 is 0. So, meron tayong x equals 0. Ibig sabihin, one of, the fact, one of the solutions or roots will be 0. Next, x plus 2 equals 0. So, by addition property of equality, ito ay x plus 2. I-add natin ang inverse ng positive 2, which is negative 2, and do it also, on the other side of the equation, 0 minus 2, makakancel ang positive 2 and negative 2 dahil ito ay 0. Therefore, x equals 0 minus 2 is negative 2. Ibig sabihin, ang other root ay negative 2. So, ang Solution sa ating 3x squared plus 6x equals 0 ay x equals 0 at x equals negative 2. So, it's quiz time! Hanapin ang solutions for the following. Number 1, x squared minus 11x equals 0. At number 2, 5x squared plus 30x equals 0. Time starts now! Number 1, x equals 0 at x equals 11. Number 2, x equals 0 at x equals negative 6. Nakuha mo ba? Hanggang sa muli. Like, 
and subscribe.